I am live right in front of the UAW Trading Center. We actually were told that the press protest would be right here, but as you can see, it's behind me. Down at Hart Plaza, a group of teachers have gathered. This is a protest sponsored by the Detroit Federation of Teachers. There have been protests all day long. Teachers say that they wanted to gather outside Kobo as the president toured to make sure he saw their message, and we saw him drive right by, look at their signs. They want federal help. They say that they don't have the resources they need to teach kids, that they have classes without teachers, classes without books, that the schools are falling apart. Many of the teachers I spoke to, they said they weren't sure if they were going to call in today, but after they listened to the governor, they decided to call him because they said he didn't say enough that they believe that just fixing the debt problem, which is what he talked about last night during the State of the State, is not enough. They want to see more done. As for what the district has to say, it says it's doing the best it can given the financial situation and that it wants to see teachers back in class. That's why it has filed this injunction. We'll continue to cover this as this situation does not look about to end anytime soon. Reporting live in Detroit, Kim Russell, 7 Action News. All right, Kim, thank you for the live report and update.